The next step in the process of calculating the weighted mean is to take the midpoint values previously calculate, calculated and multiply them times the relative frequency. So we have 21.5 and we will the x value and we multiply it by the relative frequency which is 0 0.28 or 28 percent of the total. 0. Point, or 21.5 multiplied by 0 0.28 gives us a total of 6.02, which we insert now into the table. The next cell, these are the ages 27 to 36, midpoint value of 31.5. We multiply 31.5 times 0 0.24, and this gives us a total of 7.56. The next category or group, midpoint value 41.5, we multiply this times 0 0.16, 16% of the entire sample is aged between 37 and 46, and this gives us a total of 6.64. Midpoint value of 51.5 times 0 0.12 gives us a total of 6.18. And finally, the fifth category or fourth group, people aged 57 to 66, midpoint 61.5 times 0 0.2 gives us a total of 12.3. The next step is to sum each of these products. 6.02 plus 7.56 plus 6.64, 6.18 plus 12.3 gives us a total of 38.7. This is the weighted mean. It's the average age, the average weighted age of the people in the, in the sample.